I just hit a point in this book where what? I don't even know what to think. What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be doing a really really fun vlog where I read Colleen Hoover books for an entire week. I'm so excited. So for anyone who doesn't know, I have not read any Colleen Hoover books ever. So this is gonna be my first time reading Colleen Hoover. Also, please disregard the changing of the lighting. I'm using the sun and it likes to hide behind some clouds. Anyways, I'm super, super excited about today's vlog um, because I have three Colleen Hoover books that I'm going to be reading. And I do have a fourth in case I read these super fast and there's still time left. But I kind of want to save that other one for a romance readathon that I'm going to be doing. Today's vlog is going to go from today, Wednesday, until Monday. So not technically a week. Yeah, let's talk about the Colleen Hoover books that I am planning on reading. First up, we have It Ends With Us by Colleen Hoover. This was actually gifted to me by friend... Esme. I believe it was Esme. I got this as a gift from her for hitting a thousand subscribers. So thank you, Esme. I'm finally getting around to it. I did start this one at one point and got to page 22, but I am going to just go back and read it again. From what I remember, I was enjoying it, but that was like a month ago. So I don't know. Super, super excited about this one. I've heard amazing things about this one. Um, my best friend Sydney just read this and she gave it five stars. So I trust her judgment. And next up, we have Verity by Colleen Hoover. This one, I think is might be my favorite just because it I've heard it is more of like a thriller kind of suspense, you know, novel, um, which is definitely my thing. So we'll see. I do love romance, but I do love thrillers too. I am super, super excited about um, this one. I have really no idea what this is about. I love when that happens. I don't know anything and I just dive right in. It's my favorite. So I have this one as well. And then lastly, I have Reminders of Him by Colleen Hoover, which is her newest book that is out right now. This one I've also been hearing really great things about. So I'm really, really excited to get into this one as well but also I put a poll on my Instagram because I already knew that I was going to be reading these two but I was debating between this one Ugly Love and November 9th and I couldn't decide which one I wanted so I asked you guys and you guys voted for this one I was surprised that Ugly Love did not win the poll but that's okay because I have other plans for Ugly Love so if you want to see my reaction to Ugly Love as well make sure you subscribe so that you don't miss that video we're gonna we're gonna be reading these awesome Colleen Hoover books this week I'm super super excited I'm trying to decide which book I'm going to start with I think I'm gonna start with it ends with us I think I don't know I don't know I think I want to end on reminders of him um, because I want to get a little bit more familiar with her writing before I just dive right into this one yeah I think I'm gonna start with it ends with us and see where this takes me I hope to read a good chunk of this today because that would be awesome let's go ahead and um, read some coho for the first time Please ignore all of the noise that the dryer makes in this house. It's annoying. Hello, you guys. Okay, so it's Saturday now. <laughs> I have been reading, but I just have not been very good at vlogging. So I'm back. Still reading It Ends With Us, which is not, not good for my stress levels. Um, I'm currently on page 138 and I'm loving this book. I started tabbing. Um, and I didn't stop tabbing because I hate this book. I stopped tabbing because it was making me read it too slow and I just needed to consume this book. So this is really good. Like I think this might be a five star, you guys. I am planning on finishing this today and trying to finish Verity today, which is gonna be a stretch, but I'm <laughs> trying to get myself to do it. I'm currently making lunch um, and then I'm gonna eat lunch and then really be able to crank these out. I haven't eaten today and it's like 11 something. So that's not good for my energy nor my focus. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna continue reading this. I'm having a blast and so far I'm loving what Colleen Hoover is doing for me right now.
Okay, I am on page 275, which means I'm in like the last 100 pages of this book. I just hit a point in this book where what? Oh, if you know, you know. I gotta, I gotta keep reading. I gotta keep reading, I'll come back. I'm sorry if you can hear the wind. Okay, hello you guys. I'm currently at my aunt and uncle's house. Um, Jonathan and I like to come here and hang out with my cousins and them. Um, pretty much every week. I'm just giving a quick update. I just finished It Ends With Us. Freaking five stars. Oh my gosh. I, oh my gosh. I feel like my heart was in like 14 different directions and then it like broke and then it was mended and then it was broken again and then it was mended and then I was just, <sighs> but now I'm gonna move on to very, um, I've never read like a thriller. Well, I, I have read a thriller, but I obviously have never read any Colleen Hoover thrillers. So let's start this one next. Hello you guys, so it is Sunday. Um, I don't tend to vlog on Sundays, but I have a little bit of downtime. Um, I'm currently sitting in the parking lot of my church because I'm waiting for Jonathan to get out of this thing he has to do. He works here for anybody who doesn't know. Um, and they do a class for people who want to like join a team and like help out at the church. Um, and he basically is like the tech guy. So he like plays all of the videos and does all of the sound and all that kind of stuff for this class that goes on. And so I'm just currently waiting for him to get out of that so that we can go to my niece's birthday party and then my grandpa's birthday party. Um, so we have a lot going on today, but I do have a little bit of time to sit down and read Verity. Um, I am currently on page 48 and so far I'm, I am enjoying this one. I don't think I'm enjoying this one as much as I was. It ends with us at this point. Um, but I'm super, super interested in what is going on because I didn't even read the synopsis of this book. I just kind of dove in a little bit um, and I kind of wanted it to be that way. This vlog might end up being a little bit longer um, than I anticipated only because um, I am very, very behind on schedule as far as my reading goes. Um, but hopefully that changes. Maybe I'll finish Verity today and then be able to start reminders of him like ASAP, but we will see. But yeah, so I'm going to sit in my cozy little spot and read a little bit. Hi. I apologize for all of these weird angles in this video. I'm still reading Verity. It's now Monday, by the way. Um, I'm on page 192, and I'm literally just here to give an update. I'm planning on finishing this book today, and then maybe starting reminders of him. I'm not really sure. But this book is getting so hard to read, literally just because of how disturbing it is. I'm, like, so uneasy reading this book. And it's, like, making me, like not know like what I'm gonna rate it like am I gonna rate it five stars because it made me uneasy and that's what it's supposed to do or do I want to take my rating down because of how uneasy this book is making me you know um if you've read this book then you know what I'm talking about but literally the scene that I just read I just can't I cannot like it makes me want to throw up I'm gonna try and keep reading I have like some cozy I have a cozy atmosphere happening right now but I'm like truly disgusted so that's good Sorry that the top of my head was cut off. I'm trying to do my best, but I finished Verity and I am giving this five stars because I did not expect the ending. Colleen Hoover is a mastermind. Okay, yeah, this is getting five stars. Two out of three books have five stars, so we're gonna see how Reminders of Him goes. Um, but holy crap, 
I need to text Sydney like ASAP. Jonathan's gonna be home soon. I have to pee. We're gonna eat dinner and then I'm probably gonna end up starting reminders of him because I'm just on a Colleen Hoover high right now. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys I'm sure later tonight. That was not as satisfying as I wanted it to be. Hi guys. Um, okay, it is Wednesday. I'm very behind on this vlog and I'm so sorry. Reminders of him. I'm currently on page 84. I'm really loving this. I'm really becoming obsessed with Colleen Hoover, but I think that was the whole point of this vlog. Um, I am tabbing a few things, not a lot. I'm not like heavily tabbing, just things that I either really like my maybe quotes or concepts that I really like, um, but also um, if something is significantly sad. And then I even dog-eared two pages where there's just some very sad imagery that goes on. Um, but I am really, really enjoying this. I'm having a really good time, um, which I expected um, because I literally have given the other two Colleen Hoover books five stars. So super, super excited to finish this. Um, I am planning on reading a little bit more tonight and definitely finishing this tomorrow. That is my deadline because I do need to film some other things. So I think I'm going to try to knock this out tomorrow, but I kind of want to read more tonight. Hopefully I can read a bit. Jonathan does want to watch a movie, so I don't know how much of this I'll actually be able to read. Did I even say that I'm reading Reminders of Him? I don't know. If you guys are out of the loop, I'm really sorry, but I'm reading it. I think that's everything for this little, this little clip. Hello you guys. So I am here to end the vlog, um, but I did finish Reminders of Him. I did tab this one. There's a lot of dog earring that also happened in this book. This was by far my favorite out of all of these three books that I read. I actually cried. Um, I've never cried in a book, ever. Books just usually don't make me cry, but this one, I don't know, just like the most sweetest story I have ever read. Um, this is the most connected I've ever felt to characters. The most I felt like I have ever rooted for a character. This was a, a beautiful, beautiful story. Colleen Hoover is a mastermind, um, to say the least. These are the three Colleen Hoover books that I ended up reading. Um, it ends with us. I gave five stars. Um, I did really, really enjoy this one. Verity by Colleen Hoover also gave five stars. Um, the twist at the end of this book um, really makes you question everything you just read and that always deserves five stars. And then of course, reminders of him, um, five stars. Um, I think this is definitely going to one of my favorites of all time list. Um, this is up there with the love hypothesis. If that gives you any, this might actually trump the love hypothesis. I don't know. I think I would want to do a vlog where I read them all again and then have like more I guess current feelings for the book um but this was amazing and oh my gosh I this is gonna need to go on display I'm gonna have to have a new display for this book but yeah I I had a lot of fun filming this vlog um I have never read anything by Colleen Hoover before this vlog so that was really fun now I feel like I know her writing and now I know that I love her books um and I totally understand why they're so loved <laughs> I totally get it yeah I can't say anything bad about Colleen Hoover's books um I do plan to read another one of hers in a romance readathon that I'm going to be doing in a few days. Um, so if you want to see my reactions on that book as well, make sure you subscribe so that you don't miss um, any of that. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope it was entertaining for you and I cannot wait to see you in my next one.